Hello everybody, welcome back to Pretentious Attention. We're right back where we started. Or left off last time. Shit. Anyway. Here we go. We're gonna look at this vista with Miranda. We have to give the Asari credit. Ilium is a cultural marvel. Humanity can learn a lot from their ingenuity. We were always told that Ilium is one of the safest places in the galaxy. What you doing there, Garrus? Until you fell off the grid. Sign the wrong it's the fucking best moonwalk I've ever the seen. Wrong company or walk down the wrong alley, and it's as dangerous as anywhere else. Don't let this place fool you. It's no safer here than Omega. Cool. No, you don't understand. I lost it somewhere near the transport terminal. It can't be replaced. It's a token from my bondmate. It's the only thing my uh, child has to remember her father by. Please, if you find it. No, I, I, I understand. There's the transport terminal. Uh. Okay. 25. Sell at 25. No, no, no. Wait, where was I going? Now I'm now I'm confused. Um Miranda. The Eternity Lounge. Which is Oh! I need to turn around. Saris technology? Doubles the time limit for bypass? I like that. I like that. We can use this. I'm looking for the best tech upgrades you have. Of course. We're on the right way, right? Yeah, okay. Oh god. I love that I, like, get so close to the door. Whoa. There's two people talking at once and I made a mistake. I'm so sorry. Oh, slave broker. It's okay. I'll think of something. You said synthetic insights would buy me. You said it was an easy sale. I assumed they would want an AI tech. Hello. Can I help you with something? Have you made this quarry in your slave? We prefer the term indentured servants. Before you do anything hasty, know that this quarry and signed the agreement voluntarily, and her servitude contract is completely legal on Ilium. If you actually want to help the quarry and convince the Synthetic Insights representative to purchase her contract. What if I bought her myself? I could let her go and everyone would be happy. A gallant offer with three problems. First, her technical skill merits a contract of several hundred thousand dollars. Oh, I don't have that. There's also a fee for freeing me before my service period ends. Exactly. And finally, you are clearly a traveler. Her service contract requires that she remain on Ilium. I don't want them to take me off to a mine somewhere. I don't have time for this. Fine. More power to you. Wait, now I want to talk again. I'd hope to see a representative from Synthetic Insights making an offer for the Quarian. If slavery is legal, then why are you trying to sell the quarry? I don't keep service contracts myself. I'm a contract broker. I assumed Synthetic Insights would jump at the chance for a skilled AI tech, but they won't even make me an offer. I'll talk to the Synthetic Insights really? rep. Thank you. God damn it, I don't want this paragon here. So then he says, oh, it's okay. Oh, then Can she's just right over here. How would you like to get your hands on an expert quarry and AI programmer? If you'd like to submit a resume, I... Wait, is this that slave? Synthetic Insights has no interest in purchasing slave labor. We're under enough scrutiny from the Citadel without engaging in practices the Council disapproves of. To be frank, we're hardly hiring anyone. The Geth attack on the Citadel didn't engender much love for artificial... You're prejudiced! I see what's going on here. This isn't about slaves. You just don't want to hire a quarry. What? But... Uh, but... Is it because you don't want to feed them, or do you just not like the suits? Synthetic Insights has a strict non-discrimination policy. We don't just hire indentured servants. 
Maybe I'll take this to Ilium's trade bureau just to be sure. Wait, let's not do anything crazy. <laughs> don't want to waste the bureau's time. Okay, fine. I'll go drop a contract. Just leave Ilium's bureaucracy out of it. This quarian had better be good, though. Fuck yeah. I'm so powerfully good at talking. I fucked that whole sentence up in my head right away, too. Synthetic Insights just sent over the contract. I cannot thank you enough. I didn't do it for you. I did it for her. Regardless, a kindness to her is mine to repay. Here, for your trouble. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'll get this service contract transferred. Thank you. I'll stay out of trouble. Wait, what does that mean? What? Is, what? You deserve somebody who respects you. Somebody who's going to treat you right. Oh, I think I'm just going to stop dating for a nice. while. Nice. Welcome to Eternity. I am Athena, sorry, matriarch and bartender. What can I get you? I'd like something to drink. Sure. I'll set up a tab at the drink kiosk. Knock yourself out. Literally, if you want. Just don't drink anything for Turians or Quarians. It does nasty things to your insides. Ooh, I, I saw Krogan drink a liquefied Turian on a dare six or seven centuries back. Nobody came out of that one looking pretty. Thanks for setting up the drinks. Right. Don't eat the nuts in the Red Bulls. They're for Turians and Quarians. You'll get cramps. Ooh, shot of liquor. Mystery drink. Buy it. Glob. Ah, oh, sweet. If you're hurting for things to do, Ugh. Miranda, we can't go see your sister like this. Ms. Lawson, I'm glad you've made it. We've had a complication. What happened? Is Ariana all right? She's she fine, got knocked down from S tier in League, and now no one can stand her, man. He contacted me, warning that your father has sent Eclipse mercenaries to make a sweep. He suggested that the Mercs might be watching for you personally. He's offered to escort Ariana's family to the terminal instead. What information do you have about the mercenaries? I've confirmed that they're eclipsed. God, I don't like talking over this dialogue, but I'm, warned us about I just want to talk. Try to alert I'm the annoying. But so far, they've done nothing illegal. You made the right decision. We'll handle this ourselves. You didn't mention anything about the cat. He's a friend. He and I go back a, a long No. Way. Do you want to bring in any of your other Ilium contacts, Ms. Lawson? No. You and the cat are the only two I trust on this. Making changes now could be dangerous. Are you sure you can trust the cat? Absolutely. He's one of my oldest friends. I trust him with Ariana. Lantea will follow Niket's suggestion. Shepard and I will take the car and draw their attention. Have Niket escort the family to the shuttle. Give him full access to the family's itinerary, just to be safe. Understood, Ms. Lawson. So the plan is for us to get shot down by Eclipse while your sister gets to safety? Yes. Eclipse will be under orders to take my sister alive. They won't risk anything that could kill us. I doubt Eclipse will send all their people just to stop you. You want to give Niket any backup? Niket can take care of himself. Besides, any armed backup just draws attention to him. I'm ready whenever you are, Miranda. Hell yeah. Thank Let's you. get in some fights. I appreciate this. I hadn't planned on Eclipse, but they never planned on you. <laughs> just my eyeballs just burning. Like, it tells me all these, like, nice pointers, and I don't pay attention to any of them. Oh. We're gonna... Ugh. I hate that I can't double-click on it. Yep. Damn it. Eclipse mercenary gunships. They'll be dropping troops in the cargo areas. Excellent. This is what I needed. We're gonna fuck some shit up today. That doesn't look like it's helpful. Put us down in that cover behind them. Let's hope they really do want to take us alive. Pew pew pew! Hold fire! I said hold fire, damn it! Whoa, shit! I got this. 
He's the only one without a helmet on. What are you thinking? You're a mercenary. Not firing yet. I trust you know who I am. Yeah, they said you'd be in the car. You're the bitch that kidnapped our boss's little girl. What? Kidnapped. This doesn't involve you. I suggest you take your men and go. Think you've got it all lined up, huh? Captain Inyala's already moving in on the kid. She knows about Niket. He won't be helping you. I'm giving you one chance to leave. That's more than most get. Captain Inyala ordered us to give you one chance to walk away. This whole time we've been talking, my men have been lining up shots. When I say the word, we unleash hell on your squad. So I suggest you walk away nicely, unless you want things to get... Oh, yeah, baby! Hey, what's gonna happen? Blah! Come on, pistol. Shoot like you mean it. Come on, Garrus. Shoot like you mean it, too. Whoa! Hey, buddy. You feeling all right after that? Whoa, okay. What's over here? Yeah, I understand that. Oh, shit! Miranda, that was cold, baby. Alright, open up that elevator! Uh-huh. Hang on, I've got one of their radios. I'll patch us in, see if I can get an idea of what we're up against. Shepard, I think I owe you an explanation. Ariana is my twin, genetically. But my father grew her when I was a teenager. She was meant to replace me. I couldn't let my father do to her what he did to me. So I rescued her. So, kidnapped She's her. almost a woman now. I can understand choosing to go your own way. But you stole a young child from her father. If you knew my father, you would understand. I wasn't the first one he made. I was only the first one he kept. I was brought up with no friends, pushed to meet impossible demands. I wasn't a daughter to him. I was... I don't know what I was. Ariana has had a normal life. I made the right decision. Why didn't you tell me that we were saving a kid? She's not a child. She'll be 19 this year. Oh, week. yeah! But, well, it didn't seem relevant at the time, I suppose. There are people who'd use her against me. I'm very protective when it comes to Oriana. I'm sorry I didn't trust you sooner. You deserved to know. Sounds like your friend Niket might be in some trouble. If they've got to Niket somehow, this is going to be harder than I'd planned. According to the specs I reviewed, we'll need to cut through the cargo processing yard to get to Oriana. I hope your friend can be trusted. Absolutely. Niket is one of my oldest friends. I guess you could say he was my only real friend. He's the only person I didn't cut ties with when I left my father. Is there a chance your father could be using Niket to get to you? I'm sure he's tried, but Niket's one of the few people who understands what my father is really like. I trusted him with my life when I ran from my father, Shepard. He won't betray me now. All right, let's get out of here. I'm done talking to you. Right. Well, that was pretty immediate. Let's just walk on out. Doesn't matter. All that extra time, baby. Oh, shit. Okay. Actually, let's get a sniper out really quick. I can't see anybody. Combat drone, watch out. Oh, 
Aww. Ah. Are you kidding? You, are you grabbing my dick with your hands? Oops. Wait, I don't want a shotgun. Gross. All right, now I can't see again. We need a medic. Keep the bitch back. The kid is nearing the transport terminal. All right, everybody, and I'm sorry, but that's the end of the episode. We gotta, we gotta do other things with our lives, you know. We gotta be done at the 15 minute mark that I always make last until 16 minutes or so. So thanks everybody for watching Pretentious Attention. I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.